Hey guys, and welcome back to Number Nine Farms. Today we're going to be going over our Azure order that we have ordered this month, and this is yet our biggest one. So let's get started. Over here we have the 50 pound bag of the soft white winter wheat and this is the organic brand this one is $26.95 and we make our own breads and stuff from with our grinding mill and we will be putting this in our buckets with our gamelets so we also bought um, the tinkata um, brown rice pasta, which we got the case of that, and there are 12 in the case, and there are 14 ounces each, and that was $36.17, and the weight on that was 11 pounds and 50. Um, next is the 5 pounds of elderberries. I just made a video with making my elderberry syrup, and I put that up yesterday, no, today. Um, so go ahead and check that video out if you'd like. Uh, we also got the Organic Valley Beef Hot Dogs. They are grass-fed, uncured. They are gluten-free and no casein. And these I really do like. Um, we got a 12 box, the box of 12. So I will be cooking those actually tonight for dinner. And let's see, got the, um, the next I got the a whole case of the organic traditional medicinals chamomile with lavender. This is one of my favorite teas for drinking at night. And that was six in the case for $26. I forgot to tell you the hot dogs were $82.95. Next, I got the citric acid, which I used the citric acid for a little bit in my beans and some of my cannon needs. So I got a little bit more of that. Um, the, the This right here, which has been really hard not to eat, <laughs> I got the Theo Organic Peanut Butter Cups, and I'm telling you, these are delicious. I'm going to share mine with yes. you. Yes, yes, so I got that. I got three of those and it was $5.72. And the citric acid was $4.90. I didn't say that. Um, so let's go to the next. There's four pages here in my receipt. That is my largest yet. So I got the sorghum flour. So I'm gonna be making some bread with that, with some of my sorghum. Um, that is also gluten-free, five pounds for $6.55. I got the semolina durum wheat, which this is what we use sometimes to make our pizzas. So I was able to get that for $10 for five pounds. And then this is Bruce's and Colby's new favorite. Yes, it is. This is the um, Alexandra Family Farm. It is the half and half, and I'm telling you, this is really absolutely good. delicious. It's just, as Colby says, it's just so uh, creamy, and mm -hmm. the, it's got 16% butter fat. It's 30% more creamier than regular half and half, and it absolutely is yummy. And we use this a lot, and too, in recipes. So instead of, sometimes instead of milk, I'll just put half and half in. So that is a really good product. That was... Um, Let's see, that was $27.80 for the six of them. And it's a 28 ounce bottle per bottle. And we do go through a lot, so that won't be a problem. Um, next is this ice cream, which was the sweet cherry amaretta. And this was amazing. Um, we bought two of those. <laughs> And as you can see, this is empty. We ate it in the car. We, we ate it in the car when we, after we picked our order up. Yeah. So that didn't last long. Um, next is the uh, 13 bean soup. This is a 25 pound bag. And that was $36.28. And going back over here to the Celtic sea salt or Celtic. I'm not sure how to say that. I never do know how to say things sometimes. Um, that is $8.57, and we have been using this salt for many, many years, and we also use the, the course. Yes. Uh, then there's next is the Rickaroons, 
um, coconut energy bars, which my favorite two things are peanut butter and coconut. You notice there's only one of each one of those left. Something happened to the rest of them. <laughs> there was only three. So I got three for $7. I'll um, be sharing that with you tonight. The Azure bean soup, I said that. That was $36 for the 25 pounds. That's really good, too. And the onion soup net mix right here. Um, this is uh, what we... I didn't know if there was a, any directions on the package. But anyways, this is for making for um, onion soup. Uh, the sesame snacks. Okay, this right here. This is what... Um, Last month I got, I think, what, four of them or something. And this month I ordered the whole case. Um, yes, and we had to Dusty, hide them. We had to hide them last night because Dusty was not showing any re... Uh, <laughs> control. <laughs> yes, control. They would have all been gone if we hadn't hit them yesterday. They'd he literally put, ate like three packages back to back to back. And that's how much he loves them. Um, then it's the uh, French green lentils. These, we cannot have enough beans. We really eat a lot of beans. Um, I will be cooking a lot more recipes with these products this month, so, so stick around. Um, this right here, I actually read a book on lentils, the whole thing back in the 90s. We used to make um, lentil tacos, a lot of things with uh, the lentils and put them in a lot more other soups. And I... Um, the book is called uh, Lentils Underground, so if you want to check that out. Uh, then I got um, the arrowroot powder. We use this for some of our recipes, and also I use this in our deodorant. Yes. So, and I make a lot of deodorant. Got three teenage boys left at home right now, so it seems to go pretty quick. Um, we got the tapioca granules. Um, I do make tapioca put in, which is absolutely delicious. This was $15 for this, um, six of them. And the arrowroot powder, which is really good price. Um, there's three one pound um, bags and they were $13.56. So that's really good price. Very, very good. Uh, next we have the uh, Azure uh, white chocolate chips. These are also or, um, organic and mini. So they are gonna, as Colby says, can you make some more of those white chocolate chip pancakes? So that's what they will be used for. And sometimes I make the cranberry um, white chocolate uh, bread. Mm. So that's a delicious thing. And next is the, uh, where I lost my, okay, right here, the coconut milk. Mm -hmm. Okay. L listening to you yawn. <laughs> Oh. And um, I got the case of uh, coconut milk. So we use this for ice cream and other recipes. And I saw a recipe the other day for some of that sticky mango rice. So I think we're going to be making some of that. Uh, then I got the avocado oil. And I we use a lot of avocado oil, like... We probably go through one of these probably what in about a two weeks maybe. Yeah, about two. Depends on how much we cook on the blackstone too. Yeah, so we go through that a lot, and this was fourteen eighty two, which is about the same price or more than or the less than I pay at the grocery store. And but this is a thirty two ounce bottle, and it is in the glass bottle. I paid extra for the glass bottle because we do not like plastic. But, however, sometimes you, you don't have a choice. Um, next, we got the poultry seasoning, which... Where did that go? Oh, oh right that, here. Okay. The poultry seasoning. Um, their spices are absolutely amazing. And I'm, I'm telling you, this is another one that we use a lot for our, our homegrown chickens here. So, good seasoning. I also put it in some of the soups too. I also got one on, and what I do like about theirs is it is gluten-free and it, it is gluten-free. So that's a big bonus for me. Um, the barbecue seasoning, which all these ingredients are good ingredients. And this right here, I can't wait to try. That's new for us. Um, 
And let's see, next we have the, the Desert Essence um, Tea Tree Oil and Neem um, Toothpaste. I always have been using um, organic um, toothpaste since uh, <clears throat> 2000. I used to order it from Tom's. And then I um, started, once more things came readily available, I started uh, using other products. And this is one I like and have bought before at Whole Foods, so this is a good uh, product. I definitely, I bought three of those, and the three of those came to $14, which is a very good price. Mm -hmm. That is a good price. Um, the pecans. I need to test those for you to make sure they're okay. These are the raw pecans, and I make a lot of pecan pies this time of year, so this is the two pound bag for $17, and that's, that's a very a good, good price. Yeah. And they are fit nice looking pecans. Okay, so the, the cranberries, which right, right there. at first they were under the gamma lids, and I was like, Where's my cranberries? Oh. <laughs> but the cranberries were under the gamma lids, and I was like, Oh, my cranberries, yay! So, that like I said, we make the bread for this, I make some trail mix, a lot of things go in. That we use the cranberries for so we will and this is infused with the apple juice so that's a lot better than regular sugar and then we got the buckwheat uh, um, grits or some type of they're called groats usually and those we like to make that and sometimes we like to add um, gravy to it or sometimes we add maple syrup to it we kind of sometimes make it a breakfast or a dinner so that's always a good thing. We add a lot of butter to that. Yes. Very delicious. It makes me think I want some right now. <laughs> okay, and next we have the, we got two cases of the, the jars, the, ma um, the gallon jars. These are the wide mouth um, type of uh, jar. They're almost like uh, the pickle jars, the big yeah. pickle jars. And that um, came to $35 for for eight jars and the lids were separate and the two of those came to six dollars and thirty cents which is a real really good price mm -hmm. big we've been buying these jars for years for our kombucha and our even for milking we have one that's similar to this for milking um then also we got the mustard seed powder which is also gluten-free and I only bought one of those because I don't seem to use as much of this. But this was $3.91. Uh, the Gamma Lids. Right there, we got uh, four, three of those. And they came to $22.18. Uh, then I got the five-pound bag of the rice. Isn't that right here? Right there. Okay, the five pound wild rice blend. The I got the five pound bag for seventeen dollars, which around here we eat rice pretty much like every night, if, mm -hmm. unless it's something that we. Unless we're eating beans. Yeah, <laughs> um, but Dusty, my boys love rice so much that they'll just make rice. Can we just make some rice tonight? I mean, just like randomly. So we got these different ones. Um, we, this one here was these two bags came to nine dollars, which is a very good price. And the next is the Petley Green White Cake, which is gluten free. And so, like I said before, in all, some of my other videos, sometimes you just need something easy to make. And this is what I picked for this month because sometimes I just you know, I'm tired and I want to make it easy. All right, come over here now. Where is okay? And also, what I wanted to show you was every month you get the flyer, and uh, this is the sales flyer. And this month, I which I love the picture on the front. How cute is that? He's in his little bare feet. It tells the stories. It give sometimes they give you recipes, but this little take um. Taking my lessons from the squirrels. This is a very good article. Very well written. I enjoyed it. I even read it to Bruce. So there's a lot of good things um, happening with Azure. 
and a lot of good products and we've been enjoying everything that mm -hmm. we have purchased from them guys right, so for tonight for dinner i took the wild rice blend and the dried cranberries and there you have it and it was cooked in the rice pot and now i also made the hot dogs and they smell amazing can't wait to taste them yum